a subscriber uh, requested narration, so I'm going to try this again. I'm building a triple touchscreen system to be used with Air Manager. It has three touch panels, and I'm just using an old GTX 750 card. Initially, I was able to get about 64 frames per second on the panel running the three monitors. And you'll see the homemade frame I've made here. It's kind of uh, awkward looking. I was trying to do it cheaply for a test only. You can see the monitors are supported overhead. There's a forward and a side panel. Actually, the side panel can be used uh, in either portrait or landscape mode, depending on the airplane. The idea is there's lots of flexibility with this system, enabling you to uh, simulate multiple airplanes. As you can see, I have three 49-inch monitors. They're 4K, but I'm running them at 1080p due to the limitations of my video card. And you can see the overhead panel here that augments the forward panels. Once flying here, we're using a Twin Otter. I built these panels for an Aerosoft Twin Otter Extended for use with Mark Hurst, Almost Aviation. Check out his really cool blog, or vlog that he's uh, showing how that works. Now, Air Manager now fully supports LVARs, so we can make the panel work with any of the add-on aircraft that are available. Now, my dream was to be able to build a system that could be used with multiple airplanes. If you build a hardware cockpit, you're pretty much limited to that one configuration. But I also wanted to be able to handle airplanes that were more advanced so that I had uh, an overhead and side panel to have more instrumentation. All these instruments are made with uh, Air Manager. It's just a matter of building the graphics and writing a Lua script to interface with the simulator. It works with X-Plane, also with Prepared and also FSX. Now here you can see how realistic the instrumentation can look. Here we're running the engine instruments up and you can see nice smooth movement of all the uh, instrumentation. Now with the side panel we can also add other instrumentation. For example the radios which can be selected, dialed using a finger gesture, touch and rotate around the the dial, you can see there's an inner and outer knob. You can also switch by touching the uh, transfer switch. Overhead panel also operates just like in the real airplane. Here you see a whiskey compass for a Cessna 182 in X-Plane. Everything is fully uh, cross-platform. can run on Mac, run on Windows, run on Linux, and it can support FSX also can support uh, X-Plane when prepared. So a very flexible system. I'm looking forward to seeing how far I can go with this system. Trying to uh, determine uh, if we can make it work for bigger airplanes like the 737. Check out Air Manager at humaninnovations.com.